Oh, oh. Yeah, no, never mind. Welcome back, everybody. We're, uh... I can't control myself. We're on day two. That's right. If you watch the Star Wars, uh, playthrough. Mm, don't mind if I do. Let's grab a couple cookies. Alright. Gave you as many as you wanted. Which was two. <laughs> um, but, I'll, yeah, I'll keep it over here. Oh, oops. Uh, yeah, it's day two for us of streaming. No, we know. East. Of streaming. We don't know, though. We forgot everything. We forgot at least where we left off, but I figured we can just have Rio talk to one person. It's been a busy week. It has. What did you do this week? Worked. Yeah. Same here, actually. A lot of moving of floor tile. That's heavy, huh? With my hands. <laughs> With these hands. <laughs> these big, strong hands. <clears throat> As still, people when they talk about labyrinth or labyrinth, uh, never ending story, they always talk about the the horse scene as being the saddest. No, the saddest is listening to the rock eater just talking about how he couldn't save his friends. These used to be big, strong hands. I think they're both sad, but I still give it to the horse. I don't know, man. I think because the horse one is like so over it's a the violent thing, but it's so over the top. Contact you're seeking. I need you. It's like the hearing a child squeal like that. I'm like, ah, eh, it's kind of funny. But hearing the rock eater talk about his big, strong hands. So what you're saying is, everybody who watches that movie thinks one thing, but you think a different thing. What I'm saying, hipster Chad over here. What I'm saying is they don't get it, Russ. <laughs> they don't get it. Look, I like the thing you guys like, but I only like it for a reason that isn't the reason you like it. No. <laughs> oh, shit. Here's what's happening. What? what? Talk to Elder, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. You remember, yeah. 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 Oh, the picture. That's right. There was a picture of your father. Was it your father? It was Blondie's father. I was swallowing a cookie. No, no. I was trying to piece it together. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Okay. An, an Emma left at the temple by my, by my father. The words written were meant for my mother. Okay. Uh, show this picture. Okay. So we did all these things, and now we have to talk to Elder. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. It looks really, really saturated today. This is the TV. We're playing oh, on a TV okay. versus a monitor. Oh my god, I'm in so much trouble moving. <laughs> Let's go talk to Shenva, Shenfa for the morning. Shenfa, Shenfa, Shenwa, Shenfa. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's our conversation. It's a great one. Hey. Hi, Vio. Headed to the village. I am. Yeah. I'll find something about your dad. I just know it. <laughs> okay. Very Thank reassuring. You so much. Yeah, he's, uh, that's like, he's really determined. I wish this music played in my bedroom when I woke up in the morning. It can if you want it to. I gotta get, like, a, you know what I gotta do? I gotta get a little, uh, what's the, the Arduino, or Arduino, little computer chip thing, and program it to my CPAP machine. Oh. To where when my CPAP machine turns off, mm -hmm. it kicks on a speaker in my room to play that music. Hmm. Duh! Yeah, I mean, look, I, Yeah. That's a complicated way of going about it. Or you could just get an alarm clock that you programmed to have that song from the soundtrack on it. We set up some Sonos speakers in the corner. All but, four But corners. it wouldn't wake me up. Uh, an alarm clock I need to... But what if the alarm clock was there? You two alarm clocks. Uh, I have to have two now, alarm no, clocks. no. You're right. This is too complicated. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's do your way. I want every corner of this room to have a speaker in it so that it envelops the room. I want, I, I want it to swell. And yeah. Fill the room. Morning, goat. Good morning, goat. Good morning, goat. You ever see a guy that took that uh, one of those old computers, hooked it up to his front Yo. door, so every time he opened his front door, see you later. it played the Seinfeld bass hit. Yeah. Bing, ding, ding, <laughs> ding. That's a good idea. This is great. It's a genius. Uh, where is Elder Ye? Mm. How much money do we have? I, I Not forget. a lot. We mm. had like 90 bucks, maybe. All right. Or 45. We might have like 45 bucks. 45 is not bad. It's an okay place to be not in. Not great. 
<sighs> Could be better. We um, got a lot of tokens. Oh, right, right. Don't bumper. know what to do with them. 83. Oh, we're fine. Well, well the tokens. We have to buy food, though. To, the tokens, we can we could buy, get prizes and then trade those for money. It's a really, uh... What's our... Check our inventory. How much food do we got? Not Three a lot. Three garlics. All right, let me stop at the produce bench. Let's buy... More garlic. Of course. Of How about course. two garlic? Uh, a cauliflower. What? No. Are cauliflowers worth it? No, not really. Wait a minute. Two, two of these. Two so bucks for 30. Yeah. So five of them. Well, wait a minute. Five of these. Oh, ten. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm doing my. Yeah, nah, get rid of the cauliflower. Get out of here. Just, yeah, just, garlic. just garlic. That's a lot of garlic. I'm gonna need a lot of garlic, you know. Yeah, we do need a lot do? of garlic. I'm gonna buy if I don't buy it now, I'm just gonna buy more later. This game's really it really has a lot it, it makes me want garlic more than just about anything. It's a good commercial for garlic. Where is Elder? Yeah. I oh. never thought that I could want garlic more. I, I, I fancy myself a garlic fan. A garlic uh lover. Excuse me. Yeah. How Garlic's great. You, but this game? Against all odds. Made it's me want it even more. It's like how I wanted to try eating powdered milk after playing Daisy. I often get Just curious. From her, but her hearing I feel like this is a different speed. thing. No, it's the same Sometimes thing. I don't... Be home and not even hear you knock. Like, we already have the appreciation for garlic going into this. But you don't like powdered milk. I see. I've never had it. I've never had it. I don't but know. I want to try it. It is different. I don't want to. Thanks. She lives in a bell tower? Did I just read that right? We were d distracted by garlic. And powdered milk. Wait, what if you took powdered garlic powder and in powdered milk? milk? It'd be like powdered Alfredo sauce. Hmm. We should try that someday. Dehydrated Alfredo? Dehydrado? <gasps> Russ! <laughs> I'll let you have that one. You you go to the patent office and get it uh get I'd it all like taken to patent Dehydrado. And he's just like, let me guess, dehydrated milk? And garlic yes. and garlic powder. We get them every week. Get on the dehydrato uh, line. You just look over, it's just a line of people glaring <laughs> at you. God, I wish I'd wish I'd I wish I wish I'd listen to that lady. <laughs> we go. I gotta talk to somebody again. That guy's always full of good information. He is, but you know what? Let me ask her. Excuse me. How about another one of them cookies? I need to get to Elder Ye's house. Do you have business with her? Well, that's, yeah. 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 You could say that. These are pretty dry what cookies. That that's the best part about them. Makes them crunchier. Thanks a lot. Oh, shit. I didn't listen again. Big house. She pointed behind you. She okay. Big house over there. That way. Big house. That was, uh... Oh, oh wait. Is it her? What if you dip these dry cookies in the dehydrated milk? Be a powdered milk. <laughs> That's the worst experience of my life. It's yeah, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. You there? You're that boy from Japan. So yeah, we got the tasty cake cookies mentioned that I didn't get the one time while recording Star Wars. With something. They're so good though. I love sugar cookies. Yeah, me too. The Verdant Bridge? The Verdant Bridge, you say? All the yeah. villagers told me yeah. you would know something about it. And why is that? I'm curious about all the stories behind it, and the past in general. Why do you want to I like to that they make you press the button to advance the conversation so to make ago. you feel like you're playing a video game. <laughs> Actually, True. <laughs> but even still, if I didn't touch anything, he would just stare at her a while and then start talking. Yeah. Just leave. Whoa. She didn't want to talk about it. I'm not going to hit the button. I'm going to see how long he awkwardly stares before saying so. Oh, uh, it was a weird conversation. Please. I'm begging you. Are you deaf, boy? I have nothing to tell you. Oh. What is she doing? <laughs> I don't know. I I feel like she, to know. Whatever she's doing, she's I not hitting hard enough to, to, to matter. Well, a whole day of well, hitting something at that sorry to might be enough. true. Maybe. What is she hitting? Guess I'll have to find another old timer. I just assumed it was a, a, a like a cat's skin. Take a look. I used to be an animal. 
It's it's hay. It's straw. It's a pelt. Straw pelt? Smelt. Killed the wild straw. Is that her? Is yeah, that... that's her humming. I like in this old town. Like everything is all like very traditional. Two gumball machines. Oh yeah. Two toy machines. It's the eighties, you know. That's true. They're like, well, we gotta have something new here for the kids, I guess. You know, we just talked to her and he's like, Well, I guess I'll have to find another old timer. How many times have I talked to this guy Excuse me. that he wasn't my first thought? Do you know anything about when the Verdant Bridge was built? What do you mean by anything? Oh. Like, I'm curious about all the stories behind it and the past in general. I just anything, really. That bridge has always been there. I bet everyone in this village has at least one or two memories about the oh. Verdant Bridge. <laughs> okay. Thanks anyway. Why, I lost my <laughs> anal cherry right under that bridge. <laughs> Not a stone's throw away from that very bridge. To my wife. She's in the kitchen if you'd like to ask her about it. Hello and welcome. Oh, Harold loves oh, a good pegging. <laughs> yes. Do you know anything about when the Verdant Bridge was built? I'm curious about all the stories behind it and its history. Yeah, but he didn't specify his history in so general you you'd uh, ask an this old time. Person. Speaking of pig, well, what? If your wife, old, yeah, I know said about. Russ, mm -hmm. I see. I'm not I've been looking into pegging. I moved to this this is something that now. I really would appreciate you trying with me. Hmm. She was she was very very like Is passionate about this. <laughs> Conversation still going whether I wanted to or not. <laughs> older than my husband Would you do it? Uh, I might try. I can't imagine that I I can't guarantee I like it, but yeah. I might be like. But you'd go for it. You'd, I mean, if she really a, wanted to, yeah. then I I would at least. I mean, God, I, look, those out there uh, who may be younger and are like, oh no, like. Dude, you, this yeah, is how marriage is, <laughs> you know. Yeah, you got to make sacrifices sometimes, or or you have to I go don't out even on think a limb. Sacrifice. You, you ever? Or you, you got to go out on a limb and try things uh, that you might not want to. Maybe your your spouse likes a particular food. It would mean the world to you, the, the the or to them that you try it. Yeah, exactly. You might do that. In this case, it's just it's pegging. And you know, yeah, maybe you try. But like, could you start small? And I'll see if even well, that's okay. Well, you gotta okay. start small. You can't. Oh, yeah. Look, if she came, if she came out with like that, one uh, you don't have to be a hero in this from case. Episode you just three, gotta... From episode three of Watchmen, when she had the giant blue. I didn't uh, see it. Okay, uh, the the one who was uh, in love with Doctor Manhattan had a giant, giant blue sex toy, massive, like Great oh. American Challenge. No, no, it was just a cylinder. <laughs> it was straight as can be, That's and upsetting. it was like it actually. I like oh, well, it looks painful. I don't care who you are. Uh, so yeah, you don't want to start there. I'd be like, yeah, start small, and if that's all right, then maybe we can try some more. But it's thankfully that has never come up. So so what about <laughs> you? Yeah, I'd do it. Yeah, right, good. But you know what? So back back in the day, mm -hmm. I'd say like well, like uh, maybe thirteen years ago when 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 my when my uh, when my ex, uh, Lauren, and I were going out, way back when. Okay. She always joked about, like, <laughs> like she wanted... Well, I don't even know if it was joking, but she would always say that she wanted to do it. And sometimes like, you got to start that like a joke, see if the yeah. other person and is I would just, into it. But my re immediate response was always like, no, no, please. <laughs> I, I really don't want to do that. <laughs> but you were younger then. Now that I think about it, I'm like, you know what? I'd do it. Yeah, but it would really suck if it turned out you liked it. You'd be like, I missed out on so many years it, of this. It's true. That's then, like how like, I now feel. Now I gotta go spend money on like strap-ons. Yeah. <laughs> that's how long. That's how. That's how I feel about uh, some foods where I'm like, ah, oh, I wish I'd enjoyed this food for more years. Yeah. I try it uh until i was older or i didn't try it again uh, chinese food was like that when i was a kid i had it and i didn't like it yeah and so for a year i probably didn't have chinese food again until i was like late high school early college because i was always like nah i'm not gonna like it yeah you know what i wish i'd eaten chinese food all those years Man, i hope sunset hill is this if way. i find out that i that i love pegging not that i'm gonna be doing it anytime soon but if it comes up if it comes up 
And I find out that I've been missing out <laughs> on hot ass action. I don't know what right, I'm going to do Can we make that a little less crude by saying some hot ass action instead of hot ass action? Yeah. Hot that, ass it, that will keep action. it a little bit more family friendly if, if we uh, refer to it that way. I'll try to clean it up while we're talking about pegging. Is she okay? I wonder if... What episode is this? Okay, no. it's This is still should be this year. Because I'm just curious. Uh, what the? Ah, oh, she just appeared. <laughs> I'm just curious if by the time this airs, will one of us have nope. pegged? I'm just curious <laughs> if it'll be uh, next or been year. Or pegged. Uh, like, if it'll be next year and if somebody at the FTC were to watch through this and has to listen to the conversation and make a decision. Listen. I... <laughs> This, I, is, this is just a serious discussion. We're not just, we're not trying to be filthy or anything. We may as well put this under educational. Yeah. Uh, much Sue, like the uh, much like for. the episode twelve of uh, Tender Living Care. Man, what a classic. all educational. Yeah. Oh, you know, yeah. You just reminded me. You know what we got to do? Lingam? No, we have to <laughs> update our playlists. The oh. last new one is Grim Fandango. Oh. You all right? Yeah. We should probably update those end cards, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're about a year behind. Yeah. Oh, damn it. Sunset Hill isn't this it way. It was pretty much what, when I got the job at Taxidermy is when they stopped. Oh. So March. Oh, boy. Well, that's fine. I, honestly, I thought about that, too, since then. I'm like, ah, these things well, haven't been updated. the first time I've said that I worked at Taxidermy. Should I blank it out? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, people know where you live, so. Yeah. Gen I mean, they have a general idea. All yeah. right, I blanked it out. Maybe wait. Give me come up with a different business and just say it really slowly, or at the, at about the same rate that you would say that taxidermy store. No, that doesn't narrow it. Doesn't, it's got to just say something else. What's a different? What's a fictional business you could be in? Uh, taxidermy. <laughs> yes, I'll use that. <laughs> You gotta move that tile at the tax service. It's with it's display tiles. What the it's what the taxidermied animals rest on. Ah. Uh -huh. 